Tonight, a bagel shop owner in West Orange, New Jersey, says he's being targeted by the town over his window treatments. He says that he was just trying to keep his workers cool and his bills down. But as CBS 2's Nick Calloway reports, the town says that he's got to say so long to those shades. Jarrett Seltzer opened Bagels by Jarrett in early 2020. We switched to curbside, obviously, because of COVID, and it was one of those things that just ended up working. The business model stuck. Customers order online, and food is carried out to them. Okay. Have a good day. And since customers stay out, these shades stay closed to help lower the cooling bill and keep customers from coming inside. But in July, Seltzer was given a summons from the West Orange Zoning Department over the shades. It claimed he violated a town ordinance that says all windows shall be left uncovered and shall not be opaque to the public view. But the same ordinance says all screening of interiors or shades shall be maintained clean and in a good state of repair. As far as the code reads, we're not breaking the code and we stand by that. Seltzer says zoning gave him another summons on Thursday for having advertisements cover more than a third of his windows, a claim he disputes. Right, Seltzer says he scandal. faces thousands of dollars in fines, possibly even yeah, jail time. Active. If you drive down Main Street, West Orange, you will see that every single business has window shades up. No one has any issues with their window shades. It's only my window shades and I can't tell you why. The mayor of West Orange, Susan McCartney, said she did not want to interview on camera for this story, but she told me on the phone that she believes Jarrett Seltzer violated those ordinances even after she tried to work with him on a solution. Loyal customers say Seltzer is being harassed by township officials over window treatments. I don't understand it. Uh, I'm not a lawyer. I, I am a realtor in town or whatever, so it really doesn't make us look good, to be honest with you. Seltzer has hired a lawyer and plans to fight the claims when he goes before a judge on August 22nd. In West Orange, New Jersey, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News.